Hang in. Should I sit on this shit? Sit on it. Oh, say less. <laughs> sit on it. Sit on it. I'm a strong advocate for being a slut. Damn. Bumble Welcome back everyone, thanks for tuning in. Today's video is going to be discussing the Tinder profile of a 21 year old lady with 5 kids. Oh god. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah, you heard right. 21 year old lady with 5 kids who's looking for a man. In the year 2022, more people use dating apps than ever before. Heck, some of you watching may have met your significant other on one. We all have standards we can and won't put up with. It's only natural for anyone to put their best foot forward when trying to make a first impression. But the Tinder profile today, yo, <laughs> they have steep demands versus the value she is bringing. The other lady breaking down the profile also has great points, which I wanted to touch upon. So instead of me telling you, let's watch the video together. I always see people post Tinder profiles of men online, but let's look at this woman. She's 21. She's a sandwich maker, whatever that means. She says, where should I start? Well, let's just say I am finally tired. I give up on the fact decent monogamous relationships exist in today's times. Tired of men acting like dogs and pigs. I am trying to get in shape and getting my life together. So it took her five kids and many men to finally be tired of the games. Then she says she's tired of men acting like dogs and pigs the same men she chose and the same men she decided to give the highest honor of birthing their children i am the table oh i have three kids and twins on the way serious guys only no hookups or asking for nudes i am a fun loving woman has three kids and is currently pregnant with twins and yet she is still searching for a man on tinder ma'am we knew you were a fun-loving woman a while ago. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Patient, calm, and honesty is key. Bonus points if you are six foot and in good shape. Now, everyone's entitled to want whatever it is that they want. But how you gonna get your ass online with three kids and two on the way? That's a total of five kids at the age of 21 looking for a serious guy on tinder lady narrating and speaking facts how do you even find time to date with three kids and are currently pregnant with twins the priorities are all messed up not only that she's looking for a man that is at least six foot tall in good shape has good finances and is going to be letting her be in control i'm guessing she's in the usa so the percentage of men that are six foot and above in the usa is around 14.5 percent this does not factor in anything else, just purely on height. How many of those, those men are already taken in serious relationships? Are they straight? Are they gay? And if we break it down to are they in shape? Do they have good finances? And are they willing to let her take control? If we even break it down further than that, I'm going to guess she'd prefer this guy be black. Since judging by her leg, she's black. The percentage of men available now goes from 14.5% to most likely well below 5%. If there is a black man who is over six feet tall, good finances, is in shape, has his life together, never been married, and does not have any children, why would he choose to be with a 21 year old woman with multiple baby daddies of three kids and is currently pregnant? She's literally, the kids aren't even here yet. She's pregnant with twins on the way. She doesn't realize a guy like that will have plenty of women you could date. It's just not realistic. And usually what tends to happen in these situations is the lady would tell me, but TJ, he could want to be with me regardless of all of this. And that could be the case. But what is the probability of that? I've noticed that when it comes to dating, ladies tend to focus on the possibility rather than the probability, whereas men do the opposite. Let's swap roles. If she was a 21-year-old lady with no kids, never been married, is in great shape, 
and she saw a Tinder profile of an overweight man with five kids from multiple baby mothers. Let's be real, guys. She wouldn't want to date him, or you'd be at the very bottom of her list of options. She could get the guy. Could. Possible. She could get the guy. But history tends to repeat itself. If you were to ask me, if you'd ask yourself even, what are the odds she continues getting the men that are dogs and pigs that she's been dealing with versus her getting the decent six foot tall man in good shape and has his life together? History tends to repeat itself. You don't even have time for anything serious. But this is exactly why I tell people to stay away from dating sites. Either they're unhealed, unhinged, bored, already taken, or insecure. Everybody on there is looking for a quick fix. And most of them don't need to be dating anyway. Leave your respectful thoughts and opinions in the comment section. Peace. Again, the lady narrating the video speaking facts. The Tinder profile lady should not be on Tinder. She should focus on getting her life together and seeking therapy as to why she keeps putting herself into these situations. She's 21 years old with five kids. At this rate, she could have 10 kids by the time she's 30. She also needs to be honest with herself as to what she wants versus what she can realistically get. She has five kids with men who do not need she has five kids with men who did not need to date, let alone marry her to get those kids. Yet she is requiring more from the next guy she's looking for. That's just not realistic. If she gets any decent man at all, whether he's tall, overweight, short, it doesn't matter. If she gets any decent man that is willing to be with her despite her situation, she should be extremely grateful. Her main focus for now should be on raising those kids because those kids did not choose to be born into the situation. Then she can work on herself in the meantime and then when she figures that out, she can go and get back into the dating pool. And preferably not on Tinder because let's be honest, most, most people on Tinder, they just want to hook up. It's, <laughs> it's basically trying to people wanting to hook up. And that's going to be all for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. Cheers.